Hey, good afternoon, everybody. Um, I'm here at my work, uh, getting ready to be on site for a Wichita State basketball game. Um, they're playing SMU this afternoon, but I got to be there in person. But anyways, long story short, I stopped by the card shop before I come to work today and. I'm going to show you some pickups I got. Um, I did buy some $5, $3, $1, and 50 cent cards. So let's go ahead and take a look. And we'll see what we got here. Picked up this 2021 Triple Threads purple variation it's numbered 189 out of 299 and I got this Alec Bohm triple threads it's kind of a PC collect here's some St. Louis Cardinal Dylan Carlson rookie And of course, Ozzie Smith. And the last five or three dollar card I picked up was this '86 Don Russ, the Rookies, Barry Bonds. Uh, we had a couple of snow days the other day, and I was at home with my son. And wife was working, and while he was downstairs playing, I was watching. One of the ESPN 3030s or E60, I don't know. I was watching the Barry Bonds and started going through some of my Barry Bonds stuff. And, you know, I'm kind of mixed on him being in the Hall of Fame. You know, obviously we do have scandals and cheaters and this and that throughout the league and yada, yada, yada. Does he deserve to be in? I think so. I believe so. But anyways, I'm going to quit ranting about that. I'll do a series on bonds. But anyways, this I got out of the $5 box. A uh, player that I think he doesn't get the deserve that he does. Uh, he's a great player. <coughs> Ryan McMahon. I've been picking up some of his stuff. But this is a game-used jersey with his auto. It's a sticker auto, but for 5 bucks, can't complain. And I got this 83 Don Russ, Tony Gwynn rookie card. Another phenomenal player of past. But now I'm going to show you my 50 cent pickups. Um, got this 92 Don Russ, Mark McGuire. This Fleer Brilliance Mike Piazza. It's a nice and shiny card. And I picked up this 2013 or 14 Tops Mini of Adrian Beltre. I do believe he's going to be a Hall of Famer. Hopefully, first ballot. I think he deserves that honor. And then I found another Ichiro 2001 Upper Deck Ovation Spotlights card. Picked up another Allen & Ginter 19 of Nolan Arenado, another one of my personal favorites. He's a great person, great ball player, undervalued in the hobby, but that's fine because if I can get him cheap, I'll pick him up. Finest Intimidators. Vladimir Guerrero and uh, Randy Johnson. And I picked up this Allen and Ginter 19 Randy Johnson. It's also a short print, which makes it even better. I got this Gil Hodges Allen and Ginter. It's a short print as well. That'll go in my Hall of Fame box. 
I picked up this Carl Yastrzemski All-Star card. It's basically his last photo, basically of his playing days from the 83 All-Star set. Got this ultimate victory, Tony Gwynn. Just a great photo of him. I uh, got this Paul Goldschmidt. I believe this is 2017 Diamond Kings. Aficionado. Aficionado. But you know, 2016. I'll go in my Goldschmidt collection. This Lou Brock Diamond Kings. 2016 as well and a shout out to another gold Schmidt fan is tops vintage 316 he's a great guy go check him out got this upper deck black diamond Tony Gwynn I've just been getting a lot of Tony Gwynn's here lately in this 50 cent box. I used to have these cards growing up. This is the All-Star Game version from Upper Deck. It's kind of a cool little photo of him catching a bass. They got this Upper Deck Best of a Generation, Frank Thomas. Uh, picked up this Victor Robles, Bowman High Tech. I believe it's 2017 so it's a prospect card basically here is another Goldschmidt this is this year's class 1 black we got this class 1 this year of Ricky Henderson it's a beautiful card I, I'm kind of a fan of the gold label product and of course the prices are going up on those boxes here's a McGuire Allen and Ginter from 2017 what a day sub parallel set here is a 1991 Leaf Nolan Ryan can't go wrong with Nolan and then I've been picking up some more Buster Posey because I think he's going to be in the Hall of Fame. But this is a 2019 gold label, Class 2. He's a good person. Uh, Mariano Rivera, Class 1. And here's another Buster Posey, Class 1. Obviously the 2s and 3s are more odd and then here is a 1983 tops, but it's the NL or 1982 strikeout leaders from the ALNL. Floyd Bannister and Steve Carlton. Uh, got another 2018 Diamond Kings Nolan Arenado. I uh, picked up another one of these. I am going to send this card out to somebody that I am subscribed to and I believe he's subscribed to me but I'm not going to say who so that way he doesn't know what's coming um, Paul Goldschmidt Bowman Holiday and then a best of a generation Barry Bonds Tony Gwynn And a Ricky Henderson with the Padres. And then I believe this is a short print. And this was in the 50 cent box. So I got this Lewis Robert. Again, I do believe this is a short print from Series 1 Tops of this year. And there's the code. For 50 cents, I'm willing to take that gamble. And then here is a local favorite. Darren Dalton from 95 Sports Flicks.
and a Bowman's Best from 2017, I believe, or no, 2018. And then this is 2021 20, Tops, the 86 throwback design. I picked up this red sparkle of Charlie Blackman, another underrated player. There's another Tony Gwynn, 95 Sports Flicks. I remember getting these as a kid. I loved them. Of course, I was... <clears throat> Here's another Tony Gwynn. Here's a Joey Votto refractor. Another great player. Probably be a Hall of Famer. Should be a Hall of Famer. And I got this metal. This thing was awesome. I couldn't believe I found this. But it's a 19. That's 2000 metal from Flair or Skybox. Mark McGuire. Got this Diamond Kings Donruss Optic Nolan Arenado from 2020. And Adrian Beltre. One of the variations with the back design. This is from 2017 as well. Bowman High Tech. Here is a 2013 or no 2012 Bowman of Salvador Perez, second year card. Hmm. Actually, this could be a rookie year card. It's on the back. It's showing his stats as playing with Northwest Arkansas and Omaha. So here's a 2010 Topps Mariana Rivera classic card. Tom Glavin, Topps Allegiance. Nice little card. Uh, Matt Williams, not in the hall. There's a lot of iffies about that. It's a 94 Pinnacle. I think he's a good candidate for the haul. Here's a Barry Bonds. These things are awesome. Here's a Bowman's Best that I dropped on the table. Clean that up a little bit. Here's a Gary Sheffield. He should be in the Hall of Fame eventually. This is a chrome refractor. 2006. Now, I already have this card, but this one's a little bit better shape. It's a Carlos Beltron. Kind of a PC collect of mine. Here's a Scott Rowland. This guy definitely should be in the Hall of Fame. Played with the Cardinals, the Phillies. Another Darren Dalton. Pretty sweet little card. Here's a 2011, no, yeah, 2011 Tops Finest Ichiro. It's got some surface scratching on it, but I might be able to clean it up a little bit. Moment's best. I don't know if this is some type of a, yeah, it's a refractor. And then here is a Juan Gonzalez, Bowman's Best. There's another Adrian Beltre from Finest, 2011. Some surface scratching, but that's all right. Here's a pretty cool stadium club. It's a 2017. It's a Jackie Robinson. Can't go wrong with Jackie. Another great all around guy. Here's a Randy Johnson. The upper deck VJ Lavero showcase card. It's kind of a pretty cool card watching him beat on the drums. And dropping cards in the end. And here's an upper deck. Strange but true. Greg Maddox. 
There's another best of a generation, Eddie Murray. He's with the Indians. Here is a Don Mattingly sticker from 1986 Tops. Pretty cool. Stickers are coming popular. Again, <laughs> here's a 2013 Select, Paul Goldschmidt. I should have this one already, but I picked up another one. Buster Posey. Got this Jose Altuve. Yes, he's a good ball player. Yes, he cheated. Here's a Tony Gwynn, Bowman's Best. And the last 50 cent card I got was this Jim Tomey, SPX. These are so cool with the holographic die cut. And then last but not least is my dollar stack and then I will get off of here and you can all get done listening to me. Olympics has started. It's the NHL All-Star Weekend. It's also Pro Bowl Weekend for football. Probably watch the Pro Bowl game since my Chiefs got knocked out last weekend by the Bengals. Congratulations, Bengals, for making it. Here's a Ryan McMahon rookie mini. Here's an 83 tops Dave Winfield. Here's a Mark McGuire home run heroes. Uh, Leaf Limited Barry Bonds. Bowman's Best, Best Performers, Randy Johnson. Here's another Adrian Beltre, but this one is a refractor. Here is an 85 Tops Tom Seaver. Here's a Best of Generation Cal Ripken. Here is a Blue Border Albert Pujols. NL Batting Average Leaders Guerrero and Helton. All great ball players. Here's this year's Class One Gold Label. That was Pujols. Here's a 2018 Tops Heritage. 2017 Home Run Leaders with Nolan Arenado on it. Here is a 2019 Leather and Lumber Power Alley Miggy Cabrera. Here's a 94 Ultra Award Winners, Barry Bonds. <coughs> 82 Tops in Action, Pete Rose. 1990 Score, Nolan Ryan. 89 Highlights. I just love the pose he's got there, waving to the fans. Looks like he's exhausted from his game. And a 2021 Tops Tribute. Or triple threads, I'm sorry, Mark McGuire base card. That's all I have for you all. Hope you all enjoy the rest of your weekend. Um, enjoy the hobby. Collect what you like to collect. Help each other out when you can. Um, and just keep on collecting. And enjoy. We'll talk to you all later.